It's supposed to be in spring, but nature doesn't always agree. Mike Stevens has some examples for us from the PhotoLink Library. Wishing and hoping. We've done a lot of that lately. We wished we could see more scenes like the one Mary Gabriel found in Eaton Township. Chad Depew showed us how they made ready at the Madisonville Fire Company for their breakfast. Ah, good hot breakfast on a winter morning. Wait, it isn't winter, is it? Holly Gardner from Henryville asked the question many others have. Are we sure it's the end of March? Afraid so, Molly, afraid so. Snow Squall hit Gail Long's place in Mishop and she summed it up by writing, Tired of Winter. Jeanette Wesolowski in Starucca was out after the spring storm. Ice and snow in the backyard of Lee Tyrone in Point Tell. Michael Gallagher in Archbald wrote, What a beautiful spring day. Hmm. Another Jeanette Wesolowski capture at Preston Park titled this Spring Ice Storm. One more then, for old time's sake. The leavings of an ice storm, thanks to Steve Jandreau, Forest City. Carol Elliott in Mount Cobb sent what you might label a work of art. Cold, but interesting all the same. An image here that allows for a good long look. It's from Lee Tyrone, Lakewood. The storm is over. What's left is often something we can look at for a while. Here's one from Rosemary Thompson. So, thanks to Marilyn Williams and South Williamsport, we close the books on another day. A chilly but good one. A bit odd this weather, but enjoy it while you can. It's all we're going to get. Mike Stevens in the PhotoLink Library.